naturalistic fallacy says you cannot go from statements about fact to statements about morality. So why don't you say, well, I'm not going to do that. Uh, all I've got is statements of fact. Then what about justification of statements about morality? Well, you say, perhaps there's no justification. Maybe there's, now, note what I'm saying. There's no objective justification out there. Doesn't mean to say you can go out and do what you want, but it does mean that you're not going to find the objective justification either in the will of God, e external, or in platonic forms, external, or even in nature, external. What it's got to be somehow is from within. You believe morality because that's you're psychologically presupposed to do this. And the position is known as moral realism. It's not, it, moral, I'm sorry, moral, moral non-realism. So in other words, non-realistic. You, when you say non-realistic, what you mean is there's no referent in the objective real world. Doesn't mean to say you don't have morality. It just means if it's not going to be justified by something out there, it's going to be psychological. And obviously that means it's going to be a psychological predisposition.